Yo, what's poppin' gamers? Welcome back to a brand new bad business video, and today is the day. It's finally here. I am unlocking the last mastery camo for the honey badger. I need exactly 100 kills to hit a total of 10,000 to unlock blue diamond. And then I'll also showcase it to you guys uh, in a private server so we're not getting shot at and stuff. Uh, and I'll show you in different lightings and buildings, etc., etc. Uh, but that'll, that'll be at the end of the video. So I'll do gameplay with the blue diamond diamond camo as well. Anyways, let's hop straight into this. That guy, I don't know what he's doing. Uh, we got train wreck, kill confirm. So we'll see. Oh my God, what is my aim? I did warm up a little bit before this one, just so you guys know. Dude, my game sound is actually so loud. I feel like my Roblox is reset again. Ah, this is going to be fine. Whatever. All right. My goal is to drop 60 kills this game and then finish... Uh, the camo off in the next match. Oh, going in for the knife. Very nice. Also, yes, the honey badger did get nerfed uh, quite recently after. It's actually uh, actually going to be um, getting nerfed a second time with its reload speed. Uh, but in return, sleight of hand is also getting a buff. So regardless, you're going to be able to reload it even faster than you did beforehand if you use sleight of hand on the honey badger. I don't know when this update's coming out. It could be uh, today, later today, because I'm recording on Friday, uh, which is when they update. But it might just be the new PPK attachments and some buffs and nerfs. Uh, but I don't know if they're going to be buffing reload speeds on the AS Val and sleight of hand reload speed and nerfing honey badger reload. So we'll see if they're going to be doing that, but I'm not too sure. I really want to do a new video on the new weapon today, but I don't think they're going to be updating super early in the morning. Uh, I was hoping they were going to, but I don't think that's going to be the case here. I want to see if I can rotate around be real quick. That guy did not jump down. Okay. All right, we got a lot happening here. That guy was just waiting for me outside. Oh, kind of choked that kill. Okay. Got him. Oh, my aim's so bad right now. Got him. Please, no, not an AK. Oh, oh. Mistakes were made for you, my friend. Oh, no, no, dude. I tried my best. Sometimes those uh, boxes on these maps, like these right here, don't always work for the, uh, the super jumps, so. All right, just seeing the guy spawn back here. Oh, that's a lot of people. That's not just one guy. Oh, God. Oh, give me a cover. Okay, we're alive. Jump down. Climb up here. Uh, this game might last long enough for me to get my 60 kills, possibly. That was my set goal for this uh, match. We just got to stop confirming the kills. Okay, now the guy over there. Oh, he was going for the big swing. Going for the home run. No, dude. That's unfortunate. Okay, and we got him. Nice little double. I almost choked that kill. I shouldn't be jumping out. I should have healed first. I thought that guy was going to honestly be reckless, so I, dump, I jumped out thinking that he was going to be aggressive. He was not. He was a little bit more passive. Okay, that guy was weak. nice oh 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 very nice that's two down all right spawns are flipping i'm gonna try to get over here quickly try to oh no dude we're just a few kills off of our 60 mark so close now as you guys can see we're at uh 9955 uh so we're only need 45 more 
it should be this next game as long as we can get full kills um because i think only a certain amount of damage that you do to somebody counts as a kill i think it's uh 75 something around that and you will get a kill that counts i think i'm not 100 sure but i think that counts okay that guy's just going around got him jump over this very nice i'm so happy they added that whole uh bomb protection fix to the game since he shot now i can shoot him i love that so you can no longer die due to somebody spawning in front of you well you still can but they had to shoot and as soon as they shoot their protection's gone so that's that's great all right all right we're just pushing through nice we gotta rotate again oh there's a guy looking at us whoa, whoa what's he doing here 11 and 1 let's go okay quick little kill on him let's fly over these boxes never mind oh 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 Oh, he's lucky. There's one. That guy's very weak. Oh, no shot. Climb, 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 climb. No way, dude. I lived all that. Oh, yep. Well, that's unfortunate. I was running out of mouse room. He just kept going in circles. <laughs> okay. Please don't spawn back there. The guy up there. No. Oh, dude. I hate when we're actually having a battle with a decent player. And then just people just all run in at the same time. And ruin everything. Not gonna lie though, I almost did outplay him. I used that tiny little bit of cover at the bottom of the <laughs> the spaceship or whatever this alien ship. I don't know, dude. Okay, that was the enemy. I didn't even notice that. All right, I didn't know that would count as a ladder. I was very confused what was happening. <laughs> okay. No, not the M4. Which one do I shoot? Oh, dude, there's so many. That is very... I'm very sorry, Max. <laughs> you were just trying to vibe with your knife out. My apologies. I'll take that. Hopefully that counts. Wait! We did it! I just realized. We did it. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go, boys. Kill Mastery blue diamond this better look good 53 and 10 that game by the way uh zeno i just want to point out talked about there being too many honey badger players you have 22,000 kills with this weapon don't mean to put you on the spot but <laughs> you're on I, I put you on the spot this is pretty much what's happening here uh <laughs> yeah uh, you you can't say anything about people using a honey badger i'm sorry buddy <laughs> look at that man 10,000 kills that's crazy. I officially have more kills of the Honey Badger in this game than I do in Phantom Forces. That's crazy. I think I have like 8,000 in Phantom Forces with the Honey Badger. That's insane. Hey, would you look at that? Area 51 again. So I wanted to get a different map that had a little bit more lighting on it so I could showcase it to you guys a little bit. But this is what Blue Diamond's looking like. I'm gonna be honest with you, this isn't even my favorite camo out of the Mastery ones. Uh, the one I was using while I was grinding for it is my favorite. 
But uh, if you guys want to see all the mastery camos on the Honey Badger, I'll showcase it at the end of the video. So if you guys just want to skip past a little bit of gameplay that I'm going to show using it right now, um, you guys can do that. But uh, I just want to get a little bit of gameplay with the camo. And then we'll switch over to a private server. And I'll showcase all the camos for you guys. Katana user. Where did everybody go? What is happening? I don't... I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know how I was live that long. Yeah, but let me know down below in the comments. What is your guys' favorite uh, mastery camo in uh, Bad Business? And I know a lot of people don't even like the mastery camos at all. And most people are going to probably say gold. Uh, which you can say that, by the way. You can you can choose Damascus gold over this any... any any, mas any mastery camos count, and that is one of them. Okay, it literally would not let me climb over the box. I was trying my best. Anyways, here is what Blue Diamond is looking like. Uh, I want to go through and uh, go through each of the lighting areas. So obviously it does change the more of like a paste color uh, in the buildings over there. Trying to find some darker areas. I'll go over here. That's a little bit darker. This is what it's looking like in lower light settings. Like so. It's not too bad. I just think other camos are better. Over here, it's really blue though. Very nice. Um, and if you do turn down your graphic settings, they do change quite a bit. Um, even going down by one, you get a little bit more glare on your weapon. And then going down by another doesn't really change doesn't really change but this down here is when it really starts to change right about here so if you want a lot of gloss on your weapon going down to this graphic setting right here isn't too bad and then you can go down to one we'll have it even more um, but there's like a ton of like sharp edges on everything and i don't like that so but it does look better with lower graphic settings which is cool and then in buildings it looks almost purely white uh, which is awesome. Like, if this was just a skin alone, I would actually use it. Uh, that would be pretty cool. If you guys want a color-changing skin, uh, lower your graphics. That's pretty much how it is. <laughs> but yeah, you guys can tell me down below in the comments what is your favorite mastery skin. And Damascus Gold can also count as a mastery skin. Uh, you can let me know what you prefer to use and what you like the most. Uh, I honestly... I'll show you the ones that I like the most over this one. So the first one that I really, really enjoy is Amethyst. Amethyst is probably my favorite in the game. Like, this is just super clean. It's very vibrant. Uh, and all lighting, light settings, it just looks really good. Like, just a light purple, it looks great. Honestly, it doesn't look bad. So uh, this is my favorite camo in the game, Amethyst is. And then here is the Obsidian skin. It looks pretty bad inside, but, I mean, some people might like that. But a lot of people are really enjoying this and say this is their favorite but i'm not really a fan i'm more more of more of a fan of like bright purple like the last one that you guys seen um but i would probably use this over blue diamond to be honest but it doesn't look too bad in the you know buildings it looks pretty bad like really bad so um yeah that's up for you guys to decide whether you like that or not but i personally would not be running it it's just too many colors going on because like in certain lightings it looks like it's lightly blue with a like black mix which is actually kind of cool but that's not really obsidian in my my eyes i went ahead and went from the first camo instead to show you guys one by one going instead of going backwards down the camos go up instead uh gold i mean you can't go wrong with gold i honestly think this is <laughs> better than the blue diamond one to be honest uh, I honestly wish they added this gold into uh, the Damascus gold and it made it a little bit more vibrant. And to be honest with you, it doesn't even look bad in buildings. Like, I would use this. It doesn't look that bad. Uh, but yeah, that is gold. Next up, we have Mandarin. Here's what it's looking like outside. And honestly, again, I would prefer this over the blue diamond. Uh, inside, it has an interesting look. It's more like a peach color, which isn't too bad but outside it does look a lot better it's more of a bronze this one is probably my second favorite so first it's amethyst then this one 
Um, actually, I'm, I might be lying. This might be my third favorite, but I actually do like this one. Inside, it actually looks really nice. Uh, you got like a little bit of a brightish light pink, uh, which is kind of nice. I do like that. And then this is the Tans Camo. Uh, this actually isn't too bad. Um, I actually would prefer this over Blue Diamond as well. I honestly think Blue Diamond is <laughs> maybe the worst one in the game, which is unfortunate. But I do like this one over that, and I would prefer this to be the last one if I were to choose. Here's another one of my favorites, Lavender. It's another subtle blue, and I'm going to be honest with you, this, sit, this is very similar to Blue Diamond, and it is the better one better version of blue diamond pretty much next up we got moonstone which is literally blue diamond this one's literally blue diamond it's just like i don't i don't i'm this one made me upset when i unlocked it i'm not gonna lie to you next up is rose quartz this one isn't too bad it's probably my second favorite favorite one in the game um but uh yeah that's pretty much my second one and then the other ones is what you already seen. I'm going to go back to Blue Diamond so you guys can get a, another look at it. Uh, so you can kind of see uh, the difference between all of them. Obviously, Moonstone is a little bit lighter version of this. Uh, that's literally what it is. Um, I, I think they could have did something better for this. I'm going to be honest with you. It makes me slightly disappointed. You guys let me know down below in the comments your opinions on all of this. And what is your favorite uh, skin in the game, mastery camo wise. But with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Thank you guys so much for all the support recently. I really do appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Peace out.